Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. For today's video, we are going to be reviewing a self-tanning product. This one is not new that I know of, but to me it's new because I've never tried it before. And I honestly don't know how or why I haven't tried it before. But it is the Tanceuticals CC Color Correct Self-Tanning Body Mousse in Ultra Dark. I feel like I've tried a few Tanceuticals products and I do not know why I never have tried any of the body ones. So prepare to see a couple of reviews of body self tanners from Tanceuticals because I really like that brand. But yeah, today we're just going to be reading up on the details, seeing what this is all about, and we're going to test it out and see if it's worth your money. So yes, before we get into it, please give this a thumbs up for me and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. It just really, really helps me out. So thank you so, so much. And you don't have to miss out on three videos a week. So please make sure you're subscribed. But if you want to see me review this, then stay tuned for the rest of the video. Okay guys, like I said, this is new to me. I've never tried it before and I'm honestly really, really hoping that it's good because we're going out tomorrow night for a friend's birthday and I just really, really want to have like a good color for that. So here's hoping that I think this is worth your money. But again, it is the Tanceuticals CC Color and Correct Self-Tanning Body Mousse in Ultra Dark. You already know I had to get the darkest of the dark because... I love my color. So we're gonna read up on the details on this and see what it's all about, pricing, size, everything that we usually talk about, and then we're gonna try it on. So I have it pulled up on the website. So it goes for $37 and it is 6.7 fluid ounces. So standard size, I feel like $37 is standard-ish pricing. It's like standard but a little bit like creeping up there if you know what I mean still not bad but it says this award-winning self tanning mousse not only gives you a super dark sunless tan but also improves the health and appearance of your skin exclusive mousse formula guarantees no streaks or orange color and you'll love the coconut scent guarantees no streaks or orange color we will see about that tomorrow gorgeous color our luxurious cc self tanning mousse and ultra dark gives you a deep super dark tan without the sun or tanning beds and our revolutionary formula guarantees no streaks or orange color our fresh coconut scent eliminates that self tanner smell everyone dislikes we will see about that and it's loved by both men and women alike Tanceuticals is filled with organic, healthy cosmeceuticals like acai berry, argan oil, and pomegranate extract that improve the quality and appearance of skin. Also provides a flawless sunless tan and nourishes and moisturizes skin. It says it blends easily and uh, dries quickly. It has a color guide, which you guys know I love. It's not supposed to be sticky. It says it's supposed to last six to seven days. Cruelty free, certified by PETA, no harmful ingredients. And then how to use, like everything is the same as every other self tanner. And then it says wait at least seven to eight hours before sweating or showering. So standard, but the description makes it sound really, really great. And I'm hoping that it lives up to those things, like the amazing smell, the guarantee of no orange, no streakiness. So we'll see about that. And let me see if it says anything else. No, it's pretty much the same things that I just read. So we can just start getting into actually applying because I'm very, very excited about this one. I love the packaging, by the way. It's very, very simple, but it also stands out at the same time. It feels super good, so I'm excited. But we can just start applying. I have my mitt. We're gonna get started. I have a self tanner on my face already, so I'm not putting this on my face. It's going on the rest of my body and then we will talk after. So let's just get started.
Okay guys, I just finished applying where I wanted you to see and so far I actually feel really, really good about this. I was a little bit nervous about the smell because I feel like so many times when brands say that they have like this really amazing smell, it's not like a self tannery smell, that's never the case. And with this, it smells super good. Like I feel like it has maybe like the teensiest hint of self tanner smell to it, but like 99% of this is like this really nice coconutty smell. So I was like enjoying it when I was putting it on. I kept wanting to put more foam in the thing because it smells so good. It is a tiny bit strong, but it's like a good smelling self tan. So I really don't mind it. We'll see how it wears throughout the night if it like fades away and stuff like that. But for right now, I really, really like the smell of this. Did not streak on me at all as of right now. Like I feel like it was so easy to apply. And honestly, a little bit goes a long, long way with this. Like I felt like when I was putting it on, I was doing like my usual amount that I always do. And I felt like it was like too much. Like I felt like I needed less because there was just a lot of product in such little like pumps. So that's really nice. A little goes a long way with this. So you get more for your money and it's not streaky at all as of right now. I don't know how it'll be tomorrow, but for right now it was super easy to blend out, super quick. It doesn't feel sticky at all either. So I'm super happy. The only thing I will say that I'm a little bit nervous about is how light the color guard was. I feel like a lot of times when the color guard is super light, the self tan the next day ends up not being the darkest. So I'm hoping that that's not the case. I still have high hopes for this, but we'll see. That made me just a little bit nervous because I was expecting it to be a little bit darker, but we'll see. So far, I'm super excited. I'm like really, really hoping that this turns out good. So I'm excited to wake up tomorrow and see what it did for me. Right now though, I'm feeling really, really good about it. The only thing that made me a little bit nervous was the color guard. Everything else, I'm super happy. So that is it for right now. I'm gonna go sleep on this for like seven to eight hours. And then once I wake up, I'm gonna wash it off. And then I'll come back and show you guys the final result and let you know if I think it's worth your money. So I will see you guys tomorrow. Okay guys, I am back. It is the next day and I am obsessed with this self tanner. As you can see, I got some really, really great color with this. I will say, I, I wouldn't call it like an ultra dark kind of color. I would say it's dark, but I've had darker. So it's definitely not the darkest that I've tried, but the color that I got is amazing. And it definitely lives up to the claim that it is not streaky and it's not orangey. This is a very, very like natural golden brown tan. I'm just obsessed. Like all day I couldn't stop looking at myself in the mirror cause I'm like, wow, this looks so good. It looks so natural. I just love it. The only place where I did notice it kind of messed me up was like right here. You could see there's like a spot, like a dark spot. And the same thing happened on the other side right there. So, so weird. I don't know why, but there's like two darker spots on both sides there. So that's the only thing that I didn't like. Everything else though, I am obsessed. Like it speaks for itself, honestly. Like look at this. Wow. So last night my boyfriend was helping me put self tanner on my back and he mentioned that he didn't like the smell. He said to him it smelled very chemically. I did not get that off of it. I thought it smelled like nice and coconutty. So I guess it just depends on the person. I liked it, he didn't. So it's up to you guys to decide if you do end up trying it. But I did wanna mention that. I love the fact that it's not messy at all. Like the cap really is not leaking. Like there's a little residue from when I was using it, but it doesn't leak and that like, irritates me more than anything when a self tanner starts leaking out of the packaging and it gets messy because then you get self tanner on your hands all over again. So I'm really glad that this is not. Again, with this stuff, a little goes a long, long way. So you get a lot for your money, in my opinion, with this. Like you really, you don't need like the regular amount of pumps that you would use with another self tanner with this. I feel like you get a really good result with like a fraction of the product. So I really, really love that. 
and that's really all I can think to say right now like I literally I don't have anything negative to say about it the only thing I'll say is just be careful in this area when you guys are applying so that you don't get what I got in those spots but that's literally the only place that I got it everywhere else I am golden I'm bronze I look perfect so I'm very happy with this and I honestly am so sad that it took me this long to try it because it's amazing and I feel like I'm gonna be using this non-stop for a hot minute like that happens to me a lot when I really like a self tanner I just can't stop using it so I feel like that's gonna be the case with this but that is it this is definitely worth your money if you ask me I say definitely try it it's very good and you're not gonna be disappointed so try it out for yourself but it's a huge yes for me so that's it comment though and let me know what you guys think about the color how you think it turned out on me just give me your thoughts let me know what other self tanners you guys want me to try give this a big thumbs up and please subscribe to my channel but stay tuned and i will see you guys in the next video